crude oil and natural gas both have seen a sharper fall uh, yesterday. We had seen the charts speaking the same when we had seen the divergence from the moving averages and a possible convergence we had expected. At the same time, the point to note is, here is that both respected the support levels. Oil has got its support at 71, while net gas has got the support from 2.4. So what to expect today, which position you should take in order to profit trading oil and net gas, we will see with the help of charts and indicators. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe and comment. Do not forget to press the bell icon which keeps you updated with the live market analysis. Also, you can join our free telegram channel where you get the live updates. The link is mentioned in the channel and video description. Let's start. First, we'll look into your screw followed with net gas. Do watch till the end. Now, look at the early chart. Now, see, we had discussed in our analysis, see the divergence from the prices, divergence from the moving averages and the divergence of the moving averages itself. Beautifully, we have seen a sharper drop and we have seen the prices converging. Now, 71 levels again provided it a very, very good support. With that as support, it has tried to retrace. Now, any point of time, if you see oil trading above 72, you can again buy expect 72.4 and 73 as a very, very good resistance levels on the upside. So price is staying above 72 is a good buying entry for you. At the same time, look at this. It has formed a support at 71.5 and hence this should become a no trade zone. Any breakout above and below at least should bring half a dollar move possibly. Now see stock elastic was at bottom trying to recover. MACD after a long stint, it has crossed over trading. with It can potentially recover a bit, which means 72.5, 73 cannot be denied. 72.8 is also very, very good resistance. A stock I see at bottom, it went till oversold levels and now trying to recover. Likewise, on the two hour charts, similar is the formation here. Now, one thing to observe, see the price is divergence from the 20 period. Here is the convergence. Now is the crossover. Now this level, 72.8, 73 is going to be a very, very good resistance level. But also you can see whenever there is a crossover, it brings the trend there. Whenever there is a crossover, it brings the trend there. Now there is a crossover, definitely it will bring the trend here for a little while. However, however, as we had seen till 69.4, possibility of a rise exists. Also, if you look at the two hour charts, you will find higher lows are still there. This time it has tried to breathe this channel. Below 71, anyways, it is going to stay bearish. Also, if you look at the two hour charts, retracement, one sharp red candle, if it, and only if it stays above 72, you can expect further retracement there on the upside. A stock I stick retrace looking down the MACD is still bearish trying to converge it has seen a very good sharp fall RSI also at bottom and if you look at the 3 hour chart same thing on the 3 hour charts as well here lower highs and flat bottom is seen wait for the breakout stock I stick has retraced MACD is bearish it is trying to converge remember see the MACD candle size is now trying to converge here and hence one has to be watchful here RSI at bottom here looking at the 4 hour charts flat bottom first retracement candle lower highs hence wait for it to break past 72 and then you can expect 72.45 levels and 72.8 73 levels this is going to be the resistance it needs to break past by in order to confirm the rise here also if you look at the 3 hour chart see this has come out of the bullish channel here this is a bearish sign here and also there is a potential moving average crossover which will certainly bring little more bearishness for the coming sessions be watchful a stock ISTIC at bottom, MACD bearish, see it has crossed over trading with divergence and it is still bearish. RSI here again at the bottom. Look at the daily charts. Now look at the daily charts. First of all, the sharp fall and this is the retracement channel. We had discussed this thing. Higher lows are seen, higher highs are seen. 75 provided a very, very good resistance with 75 and resistance. Now remember any point of time. Today, if it stays below 71, it will bring a very, very sharp breakout. You have to be careful there. If it stays below 71 and then 70, you can expect that oil has taken its trend and then it is going to stay. See the drop there, the retracement zone and see the angles of this. You know, the angle is different, angle is smaller here, which means the bullishness was smaller here, which means a breakout here will bring a catastrophe again for oil and hence one has to be watchful. At the same time, look at this still till the time it stays above 71 today, one should not be afraid of anything and it can possibly rise back. 
स्टॉक आइसिंग नियर टू टॉप मैगडी हेयर ऑल्सो इट इज बुलिश बट ट्राइंग टू कन्वर्ज क्रॉस ओवर फॉर एस एल आर एस आई ऑलमोस्ट फ्लैट हेल्स फॉर द डे यस यू कैन सेल एट सेवेंटी वन पॉइंट फाइव बट देन सेवेंटी वन इज द लेवल आई विल लुक फॉरवर्ड टू ब्रेकिंग एंड सस्टेनिंग बिलो विच इट विल ब्रिंग द बेयर्स फॉर द कमिंग सेशंस एंड देन वी मे सी इट हिटिंग सेवेंटी सिक्सटी नाइन पॉइंट टू सिक्सटी एट लेवल्स इन द कमिंग सेशंस ऑन द अप साइड यू कैन बाय हेयर एट सेवेंटी टू लेवल्स बट दिस इज स्टिल अ रिट्रेसमेंट नॉट अ रिवर्सल फॉर द डे यू कैन बाय एट सेवेंटी टू एक्सपेक्ट सेवेंटी टू पॉइंट फोर एंड फाइव लेवल्स फर्स्ट टारगेट देन सेवेंटी टू पॉइंट एट एंड सेवेंटी थ्री लेवल्स नेक्स्ट टारगेट ओनली एंड ओनली इफ यू सी ऑयल ट्रेडिंग अबाउट सेवेंटी थ्री यू कैन पॉसिबली एक्सपेक्ट इट टू राइज मोर टेक योर पोजिशन अकॉर्डिंगली ट्रेड विद स्टॉप लॉस ट्रेड विद ट्रेलिंग स्टॉप लॉस नाउ लेट्स एवे लुक एट नेचुरल गैस एंड बिफोर यू प्रोसीड इफ यू वॉन्ट टू लर्न दिस आर्ट ऑफ ट्रेडिंग प्रॉफिटेबली शुड जॉइन माई मेंटरशिप बैच ट्वेंटी सेकेंड बैच स्टार्ट ऑन Fifth of June, register yourself now itself. Reach out to me for more details. My Telegram and email IDs are mentioned in the channel and video description. Also, you can be part of my Signals group where trading as per the Signals definitely will benefit. Now let's have a look at natural. Now see, uh, Nat Gas went till towards two point four two four three levels. It is traded outside Bollinger Bands, and since then it is just consolidating here. Higher lows are seen, lower highs are seen. and a good resistance at 2.48 and 2.45 is seen hence 2.48 and 2.5 is seen hence if you see trading about 2.48 buy but then till 2.5 it has got very very good resistance any point of time if you see it trading about 2.5 you can buy and expect it to rise again 2.55 2.6 levels can be seen there we have to be watchful there right now if you see the drop retracement drop sharp a drop retracement it is just consolidating here before it gives another breakout now any breakout below 2.44 you can sell again however 2.42 2.4 is a very very good support the stock is still retraced macd willing to cross over now this is important one rise drop second cross over which means it will bring further retracement on the upside the stock is rsi at bottom and if you look at the two hour chart similar observation is seen on the two hour charts here Higher lows, lower highs. Wait for it to break out. A stock has stick recovered. MACD trying to converge crossover for a buying entry, and possibly it can try to retrace a little. RSI is also trading at bottom. Now look at the three R charts. On the three R charts, similar consolidation. Now also one must look at one point here is the price divergence from the twenty period moving average. Now the crossover on the moving averages. Also, the divergence of the price from the moving average. Now, this zone is become critical, two point five, two point five five levels. And till here, we should not consider this as a reversal. This is crossing over here. This is bearish indication for near term. Stock ISTIC went to oversold. MACD is bearish, trying to converge crossover for a buy. RSI trading at bottom. And if you look at four hour charts, now on the four hour chart, see the price divergence. too much from the moving averages that is why we can see also the divergence between the moving averages this is an indi indicated that there could be a potential fall now the moving averages have started to converge crossover yes if you see it trading about 2.48 you can buy however 2.5 is the level and then 2.5255 very very good resistance exists till 2.55 any rise about 2.55 should be an indication that it is trying to reverse else this may continue with the downside now see this is the channel it is created the highs of this channel are at around 2.5455 levels which you should be watchful of retracement till 2.45 2.55 possible however not a reversal confirmation stock has tick oversold macd here also is bearish trying to converge rsi is trading at bottom now look at the daily charts on the daily charts first of all for the <coughs> For the near-term prediction on net gas, we have discussed this several times. Till the time it stays above two point eight oh six triple bottom levels, we can expect that net gas is going to remain bullish. That is what we had discussed. We had also predicted that two point eight levels and can be expected two point eight. And in fact, we were expecting three three point two. However, it has retraced for now from two point eight levels. Now, see, this is the channel in which it is trading, which has a support at two point. 
थ्री एंड टू पॉइंट टू लेवल्स ओनली एंड ओनली इफ नेट गेस ट्रेड बिलो टू पॉइंट टू यू कैन कंसिडर दैट एज अ बेरिश मूव नाउ सी हियर ऑल्सो द प्राइस इज डाइवर्स फ्रॉम द मूविंग एवरेज इट हैज टू कन्वर्ज इट कन्वर्ज नाउ पॉसिबली वी कैन सी इट ऑल्सो ट्रेडिंग स्लाइड वेज और विद अ स्लाइड बेरिश मोमेंटम टिल टू वॉट्स टू पॉइंट फोर बिफोर लुकिंग फॉरवर्ड टू रिवर्सल नाउ ऑल्सो लुक एट दिस दिस इज ट्रेडिंग इन दिस बेरिश चैनल द हाइज ऑफ दिस चैनल एट अराउंड टू पॉइंट फाइव टू पॉइंट सिक्स and now this is the first red candle and hence second red candle may follow and uh, that is why if you see any point of time if you see net gas trading below 2.54 today you can sell expect 2. or uh, 2.44 today if you see trading below 2.44 you can expect 2.4 levels is the first targets trading below 2.4 stay short for 2.36 2.3 levels that is going to be a very very good support for net gas there on the upside you can buy here at 2.48 expect 2.45 2.52 2.55 very good resistance is still 2.55 staying above 2.55 will bring the bulls there and expect 2.6 levels once again take your trades accordingly trade with a stop loss trade with a tailing stop loss do not forget to like share subscribe and comment join my mentorship batch and signals channel reach out to me for any of your trading or training queries my telegram and email id is mentioned in the channel and video description thank you very much have a great profitable trading day ahead thank you